Okay, so I have this uh, 2011 F-150 EcoBoost, and I'm gonna show you how um, to fix a torque converter shutter. And so what I've been having happen is, um, this is what it is. It's instant lube guard, instant shutter fix. And basically what happens is, um, basically what happens is when I'm driving down the highway and like fifth or sixth gear, and I try to accelerate just a little bit, then it shakes really bad and it feels like I'm driving on rumble strips. And from all the research I've done today, it shows that it's caused from the torque converter slipping and this stuff is supposed to fix it. And I've seen a bunch of other people on YouTube that have put it in and they said that it, um, one guy said that he made it like 60,000 miles before the shutter came back. So I went and bought this. I'm going to show you guys how to put it in real fast. Okay, the first thing you're going to do is turn the car on. Okay. And then all you need is a three-fourths uh, wrench to get the drain plug loose um, on the transmission. Then you cut this and just pour it in. Once you get up under here, be careful not to touch the exhaust. It's going to be hot. So don't touch the exhaust. Um, you're gonna get your wrench and you're gonna loosen that top up there. There it goes, okay. Now it might be kind of hard to get. The first time I took it out, I had to get a, um, what's it called? First time I took it out, I had to get a hammer and kind of hit it loose um because it wouldn't come out so just keep that in mind um let's see if i can get it by hand now yeah just be careful not to touch the exhaust it's hot just be careful Yeah, probably gonna burn yourself a little bit, but that's okay. Okay, after you get the bolt out, you're gonna cut the little top off and you're gonna stick it up in there, just like that. And you're just gonna squeeze the bottle into the, into the transmission. Okay, so see now, so I got it all put in. So now you're just gonna, I would put the, um, I put the little dipstick part back in without the bolt. You're gonna pop that back in and you're gonna put your bolt back on or your cap, whatever you wanna call it. Okay, and then just try to get it as tight as you can by hand. Still going, there it goes. Then you're gonna get your wrench and just uh, tighten it back up. And just try to get it as tight as you can. Don't, don't hit it with a hammer or try to get it jammed on there really good. Okay, it's on there nice and tight, and that's pretty much about it. I'm just filming this quick video. I have uh, I put in that instant shutter fix about probably three, three and a half weeks ago. And I just wanted to update you guys that this stuff has been working great. Um, the issue I had with feeling like I'm driving over like the rumble strips on the side of the highway, uh, and, or like the vibration, whatever you want to describe it as, is completely gone. Um, it's perfectly smooth cruise control everything which is the main time that it would happen is when I was using cruise control um, But yeah, everything is perfectly smooth works great And I definitely recommend trying this out before you spend two grand to get your torque converter fixed